Hi, I'm Professor Hannah Holmes and I'm in charge of the first year microeconomics program here at McMaster. My colleague, Professor Bridget O'Shaughnessy, she looks after the macroeconomic sections and she's not here so I'll tell you a little bit about her course afterwards. We're both very much the same page. We use a lot of technology in the classroom. This is something that we're really big into so there's all kinds of neat stuff that you'll be able to do in the course. Do assignments online, we have podcasts available, uh, we have lecture notes available, all kinds of stuff to help you out. Now why should you take economics is what you're probably wondering. Well economics, we study how society allocates scarce resources to satisfy unlimited wants and it's all about decision making. In my micro course I look at how individuals like you and me and firms and businesses make decisions and that process of decision making will serve you well in everything you do. I think you'll make better decisions all the way around once you see how we do it in economics. My colleague's macroeconomics course, that looks at the big picture. So it looks at economy-wide issues like unemployment and inflation. And as you know, the economy's been pretty up and down lately. And I think this is a perfect opportunity to understand why things happen in the economy and understand how we can fix things. On average, there's about five to 600 students in each one of our sections. But don't let that throw you because we're really good. We can actually answer questions in class. We try to make the big classroom feel really small. So it'll be a good experience. Now, personally, um, I'm really into the teaching aspect. And so is Professor O'Shaughnessy. Uh, this year, we were nominated by the McMaster Students' Union for teaching awards. So you can tell that we're really dedicated to what we do. And the research that I'm currently doing now involves the impact of all these new technologies on classroom experiences. And I'm finding some pretty interesting stuff. So I hope to see you next fall in first year economics.